DJ here with the Chief Peak, and today we're going to be doing a 15 minute chest workout. For this workout, we're going to do 20 exercises performed all in a row and just one set of each exercise. So, no repeating the same exact exercise. Our working time is 30 seconds, our break time is 15 seconds, and for this workout, there are no extended breaks. If you like this workout, hit that like button and let's get to work. All right, we got about 30 seconds until we get started. If you have a fitness tracking watch, be sure to start your workout now. Our first exercise that we're gonna go into is push up on your dumbbells. So grab your dumbbells here. We're gonna put them out where we normally do our push ups. This is gonna allow us to go a little deeper on the push ups to really stretch out the chest here. If you want, you can do these on your knees or on your toes. Come down, touch the ground, come back up. Here we go, a couple seconds till we get started. Let's go. Come down and then up. Down and then up. There we go. Don't forget to breathe. Keep that core nice and engaged. Try to drop that as low as you can. Stretch that chest out. There we go. Okay, now we're gonna go into a staggered hand push-up. So what we're gonna do here is we're gonna put one of the dumbbells low, one of the dumbbells high, so our hands are gonna be like this, and then we're gonna do our push-ups like that. Here we go. So go down, and then up. Down, and then up. I promise you tomorrow, you're gonna feel this in your upper chest because of this one. There we go. Keep that core engaged. Keep pushing. There we go. Last one. There we go. All right, we're just switching sides here. So staggered hand. Push up, right side goes a little higher. The lower side should be at like your normal pressing height. Here we go. Alright. Down, down, and up. Down, and up. Woo! Let's go. Come on! If you have to, drop down your knees. You're trying to keep pushing. Don't give up. Come on. 10 seconds. Here we go. Woo. All right, next one we're going to is a wide grip push up. You don't have to use dumbbells if you don't want to for this one, but you absolutely can if you want. I'm going to try it, see how it goes. So we're going to get those dumbbells nice and wide this time. I'm flaring mine out just a little bit. So my hands are like 10 to 2. Come down and up. Down. Ah, come on. Push it out. Keep going. Come on. Woo. There we go. All right. We're gonna flip over onto our back here. We're gonna do declines. So, curl these up right here. Get those hips nice and high. Get that glute brace position. We're gonna press up, come back down. There we go. Come on. Keep those elbows nice and low. Press up. If you want, as you come up, you can rotate the hands. Tap those dumbbells together, come back down. Hips up. Here we go. Next exercise we're going to do is a reverse grip press. So this time, our palms are going to be facing up towards us. Here we go. So hips are staying on the ground here. Curl the dumbbells. Right here, come up. Tap them together. Palms stay facing up towards your head the entire time on this. Keep pushing. 
Burn that chest up. Let's go. Push it out. Come on. One more. There we go. Next one we're going into is a crush press. So what we're going to do is we're going to bring the dumbbells together, hold them together, and press them like that. And we go bring them up. We go up and together. And right, come down. They're staying together the entire time. Pushing back up. There we go. Come on. Push it out. Keep going. There we go. This time we're going into flies. So our arms are going to be out here. Slide in the elbow. Reverse grip. So as we come up, our palms are going to face up towards our head here. So bring them up just a little bit right here. There we go. So as we do the fly, palms are coming towards us at the top, going back to neutral. If this gets too heavy, you can just do a reverse grip press and then a negative fly. Bring them back in. Reverse grip press, negative fly. There we go. Okay, this time we're just going to neutral grip fly. So the whole time we're just neutral grip. Keep pushing yourself. Let's go. Burn that chest up. Come on. Here we go. Come up. Back down. Good controlled movements. Again, if this is too tough, you can just do a chest press and then a negative fly. Bring them back in. Chest press, negative fly. There we go. All right, we're going to stand up here. We just need one dumbbell. We're going to go into a high crossover on the left side. So what we're going to do, we're going to get a little bend in our arm, come up and across the body here. Here we go. Come up and across. Up and across. Try to get it nice and high. Squeeze that chest. Come on. Push it out. Don't forget to breathe. It ain't supposed to be easy. Come on. There we go. All we're doing here, we're just switching sides. Right side, high crossover. Woo! Chest is on fire. Let's go. Come up and back down. Up and back down. There we go. Come on. You're pushing it. One more. Here we go. All right, next one we're going into is a low crossover. So we're going to bring it across nice and low. Squeeze that chest really on the outside for sure and on the inside. Here we go. Left side, low crossover. I'm going to cross, squeeze the chest. The dumbbell is staying nice and close to the body. Focus on the chest. Come on. Keep pushing. Squeeze the chest. You can feel it tightening up. All right, we're going in to the right side now. Woo! Feeling it. Here we go. Here we go. Come on across. Squeeze. Come back. Oh, there we go. Woo! 
Put your hand up there. Feel it. Oh, yeah. Oh, come on. Keep pushing. One more. There we go. All right, we're going to drop back down here. If you have a bench or something, you could use it for this one. You don't actually need it. We're going to do a lying side press. So on our left side here, and then we're just going to try to push up, come back down. Here we go. So right here, push up, squeeze the chest, come back down. Push up, squeeze the chest, come back down. Come on. Squeeze. Squeeze. Get that contraction. Come on. Here we go. Don't turn and lay back. One more. Here we go. All we're doing here, switching sides. Here we go. Keep pushing. Let's go. Yep. Yep. Oh, squeeze the chest. Try to get a little hold at the top. Come on. There we go. There we go. Alright, we're gonna fall. We roll over onto our back here. I'm gonna hold the dumbbell. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put my hands, my thumb across the bottom of the handle, and then right here we're gonna do a pullover, up down, and then up. We're gonna focus on the chest here. Try to use the chest to perform a pullover. What you can try to do is, with your hands, try to push out towards the outside of the dumbbells as you're coming up. There we go. All right, we're gonna stand up. We're gonna do a dumbbell squeeze here. So just grab one piece. Don't hold up under it. Hold on the outside and force yourself to squeeze the dumbbell together. There we go, like you're trying to literally crush the dumbbell here. Come on. Oh, squeeze. Focus on the chest. Let's go. Come on, keep pushing. Squeeze the dumbbell. Cavalier crossover right here, left side. So what we're gonna do is we're just gonna bring the dumbbell across and then back. Here we go. Come on, bringing it over, squeezing the chest, coming back. Bringing it over, squeeze. Focus on the chest. Let's go. Squeeze. Squeeze. Here we go. Switching sides. Cavalier crossover. Right side. Woo! My chest is on fire. Here we go. Here we go. Come over. Squeeze the chest. Back. Squeeze, put your hand up there, make sure you're squeezing. Really focus on it. Come on. One more. There we go. Alright, last move we're going into is power push-ups. 
I'm gonna put some of them down on the ground here. If you want, you can do these on your toes. I'm gonna do mine on my knees here. We're gonna drop down and then explode up. Might have to go forward, right? Here we go. So drop down, explode. Explode. Ah, push as hard as you can. Ah, let's go. Keep pushing. All right, there we go. Woo, that's the end of it, but we ain't done. All right, we got one more thing. We're gonna just do some quick push-ups, as many as we can until we're burned out. If you wanna do it on your knees, you can. If not, let's go. Last little burn out. Oh. Woo. Let's go. Here we go. Keep pushing. to check out our other little 15 minute burnout style workouts just like this one for the rest of the body. See you guys.